This is Master Fitness. If you're gonna work out at home, you're gonna need equipment. If you go to the gym, you go into the gym because they have equipment. You're probably gonna need a membership. You're gonna to have to pay. You're gonna to have to drive over there in most cases. If you work out at home, and if you wanna do it in your garage, any space you have open where you wanna set up that, you're gonna need equipment. You can only do so much without equipment. Sure, you can do push-ups, you can do sit-ups, but in order to get to where you really want to be at, the cuts and tones and all of that stuff, and want to get there at a quicker level, you're going to need some equipment. And I'm going to go over that this morning. I also have my link down below, my link tree link, that all, where I get all of my equipment at on there. It may be some sales on there. If you click on my link and go in there. I also have my YouTube uh, channel on there. I'm on YouTube. Okay, so we're gonna go over some stuff some of the stuff you're gonna need You don't need a whole lot of equipment But there's certain things you need if you're gonna work out at home and if you're gonna build your home gym It's so important because once again to get that everything cut up and toned up and chopped up the way you want it Once again, you're going to need equipment and what I have right here is my dumbbell set right here, okay? And again, on my link tree link, right down there on Amazon, that's where I got my stuff at. I'm affiliate associate with Amazon, Dick Sporting, and all of that stuff is on there. You may be able to get some sales, click on there, check it out. But I got this right here, okay, on my Amazon link right here, all right? What I have right here, my... My biggest one is 25 pounds, then it come all the way up 25, 20, and it works the way all the way up, okay? It's up to you on how much you want to get as far as, as, far as uh, weight, okay? My highest one is 25 because the deal with that is that on the 25 pounds, you can do, let's just say, you can, you know, if I get the 30 or 40, so, ooh, I can do that, okay, whatever, okay? Instead of running out buying more, just increase the reps. You ain't, ain't going to do no 140 reps. <laughs> that ain't going to happen. So, but however, so if you want to go out and get heavier weight, eventually you can do that. Starting out, this right here will get you going and may last you some years. And once again, in working out, just increase the reps before you go out and buy more weight. Okay? Because this right here is sufficient to get you going. All right? And then the second thing you want to get, you want to get you a dumbbell right here. I have dumbbell right here with weights on here. I, I'm sorry, barbell, okay? This barbell right here, okay? And this right here have weights on here. This right here is a total of about 100 pounds weights I have at the place on the floor behind me. So this is the type of stuff you're going to need right here in order to work out at home. Okay. All right. Then the next thing I want to talk about, you're going to need your bench right here. The bench right here is for doing bench presses. You can also do uh, sit-ups off the edge of the bench, like in my YouTube videos. Okay. And you can do a whole lot of things with a sit-up bench. You're going to need this. Okay. All right. Let's go to the next one. Okay. The next equipment that I use, that I highly recommend if you're gonna work out at home, if you're trying to cover every muscle group and get that body the way you want it, is that I have a universal machine that covers almost every muscle group. This universal machine right here, uh, it covers the legs, the leg uh, extension to work these quad muscles right here. It also has a uh, seated bench pad right here where you can do isolated curls on it right here to work the bicep muscles right here, okay? It also, right here, you can do the seated bench press to work your chest muscles and also working the tricep muscles at the same time, okay? You can also adjust it up here to where you can do the pectoral fly 
to really target those inner chest muscles. You can also do the tricep extension, which develops the tricep muscles right here, the tricep extension. Let me show you what I'm talking about. Okay, and you just work them tricep muscles right here. All right, and you can also remove this part right here. It comes with a longer bar where you can do the lat pull down to work these lat muscles back here to develop them. It covers almost every muscle group. That's why I believe it's so important to have, have a universal machine at home if you're serious about working out. Okay, once again, the pros and cons. The pros for me working out at home is 100. Uh, for me, there is no cons. I don't have to drive nowhere. I got the equipment I need to get in shape. I am in shape. I look good because I work out and I get everything in right at home on my time frame, get in, get it done, and get out. Again, I ain't knocking nobody that go to the gym. If you're going to go to the gym, fine. People go there for different reasons. But the number one reason is they, they have equipment there. That's why you're going. That's the number one reason. And most likely you gotta have a membership and all of that good stuff. But if you got it at home, you got your own membership at home because you, you bought it to your equipment you got it at home. I have a link tree link down below. I'm a affiliate market with some of these brands where I get all of my equipment from. The Amazon link is down below, Big Sporting Goods, and I have a lot of affiliate brands that I work with on there. Click on there and take a look at some of that stuff and see what kind of sales they got. You know, it may be a good time to go in there if you're interested in building your home gym. Again, for me, the pros is all pros of working out at home and building my home gym. And if you're interested, click on there, take a look at some of this stuff, and see if it can help you. And the last piece of equipment I want to talk about real quick, I work with resistant bands right here. Resistant bands is good to change it up every now and then. They're very good for toning and strengthening and also to get off those weights every now and then. So you just pull up right here, you're working these uh, lat muscles right here, for example, and you just go back down and just pull back up, okay? And again, all of the equipment that I have talked about I am a affiliate marketer with those brands. I get my equipment from them. Maybe some good deals on there. If you're interested in building your home gym, click on my link tree link down below and just take a look at some of this stuff. Again, the pros for me of working out at home is 100. I have no cons. So if you have that same thought process and like this, carve out a space in your house, mine is in my garage, and I love it. And you can go on there, look at some of my equipment uh, and some of the things that I talked about this morning, and uh, go ahead and build your gym out. Get going and get that body right. This is Master Fitness, the building of a machine.